I needed to show you that I have ready to unbox the uh, action figures. No, this isn't it. This is, th well, this is it. I do want to get to this because it is Throwback Thursday here on the channel. Um, these are Star Wars vintage action figures, but I also happen to have uh, Marvel vintage styled or retro style uh, figures in this particular box. And also the uh, greatest hits for the Black Series line. That's the, the series I've been looking forward to because there's some effective uh, repacks of Troopers, which will also be nice to print out like in, in this scale, if the model uh, is, is available. If not, I'll ping the, uh, the artist. In this box sits the potential answer to my potential problem. And, I, and I'm saying that, and I apologize for uh, bumping the desk there. It's a big knee. I have a big knee. Uh, oh, you got you want more cowbell? I don't have it. Jedi took it. You got to ping Diana. But don't do it right now, because then, like, my phones will go off. Because I'm like, it's like, bling, 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 bling. Oh, uh, and a stretch? There is your stretch. Okay, so, don't you love Twitch, everyone? So I do. I really genuinely do. So much more fun than YouTube. In this box, I have... A product that I ordered, and I may not... Oh, interesting. I got a 3D tempered glass screen protector and a, a case. I ordered both. It was like a part of a promo pack. And uh, they threw in uh, some uh, buds. Now, I paid for this package. Like, I paid for I paid for these. This got thrown in as a bonus, which would be kind of neat, I think, potentially, if I keep it. This is my big question. Uh, this is what I wrestle with. I think the uh, the OnePlus 9 Pro is a no-go in terms of the uh, um, the scrolling issues, and it could be something related to the LTPO screen. I think I got that acronym correct. Uh, let's make sure. Yep, OnePlus 9 5G. They just love tacking 5G onto everything anymore, don't they? Like, hey, you would you like a hamburger 5G? Sure, why not? Oh, hang on. Okay. So, this is the OnePlus 9 5G. Unboxing it for the first time. Open up oh, the box. There it is. Uh, <laughs> gonna make a mess. Gonna have some more beans. Mm hmm. Would you like 5G fries with that? I would, actually. So, theoretically, this is going to be fine. I'm going to hold on to everything because I only need to test. It feels like, right away, it feels exactly like the, um, the uh, this one. The, what's this one? The 9 Pro. The 9 and the 9 Pro. Okay, so let's boot her up. Where's the power button on this dang thing? Like, this is, like, this phone, the power button's over here. This phone doesn't have a power button. This phone works by telepathy. I'm like, oh my god. Oh, I can, I can, I can print oh, a, a OnePlus 9 Pro 3D case? Really? Really? That's cool. I might do, I, I might do that. Although, I'm not sure I would trust a drop or a fall uh, to a, a 3D printed item. All right, so it's, it's booting up for the first time. Hello. Hi. My question is, in terms of fluidity, uh, if it's going to work. And so, hang on, I gotta get on my Wi-Fi. The reason why I'm, I, I wanna check all this is because I'm the only thing I'm looking for is better scrolling performance in one, if not two apps. And, and I'll know pretty quickly just by launching the default Google app. If there is a bit of jumping around, there's an issue. Now, keep in mind, for the past few days, I've also been using the uh, Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra 5G Pro Premium Plus um, Platinum Package. And I've also noticed, I mean, it's got Android jank, that's a given, uh, but um, kind of like iOS jank, it's a given. The uh, uh, You know where to look for it. You know, you know where it is, right? You can expect it. You can count on it, which is okay, I guess, for 2021. This is what passes for a flagship. Uh, so... That I've noticed a different kind of scrolling behavior in this. Yeah, yeah, Cosmic Blip, it's not setting the scrolling to the correct frame rate. It's not that. It's not that. It, there's something else that's potentially wrong with the 9 Plus. The OnePlus 9 Pro! Oh my god. 
And I'm not the only person to document this. Anyway, there's a different scrolling anomaly anomaly on the S21 Ultra. Like you'll you'll scroll, and and I've noticed like it's a scrolling anomaly that seems to happen when there's some degree of caching going on. So I notice the the scrolling jank on the S21 Ultra specifically, like in ex for one example, because I've seen it in, across several apps. In, in photos, if I'm scrolling down and it's caching, what'll happen is it'll scroll and it'll actually do this. It'll bounce. It's but not like a, a fun bounce, like you reached the end. No, it's more like, but it's a smooth. It, I'll give it this. The the sloppiness is at least smooth. <laughs> so I can't get upset at Samsung too much for that. I mean, I still can slag them because they didn't, you know, watch, you know, the finer details of their their product, but. Give me a second. Uh, I've got to uh, got to get on my Wi-Fi here. <laughs> okay, talk amongst yourselves. Do a straffle. God dang it! Can I type on this thing? Uh, I, can't, I can't see. What the hell? Okay. Um, the thing I like about the OnePlus series is at least, at least it's close to a stock Android. That's the thing that's driving me nut nuts about uh, the the Samsung device. It's, it's really, um, it's getting long in the tooth already. And I'm like, oh my God, Samsung, get out of my way. Let me use the device, please. Thank you. That'd be great. I know I'm using a Samsung device. You don't have to slap me in the face every other minute. Um, okay, almost done. It's difficult to, uh, <laughs> I'm multitasking right now. I'm very much multitasking. All right, I think I typed that in correctly. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm having... What? What is going on? Dude, like my... Okay, so finally it connected. Like, oh my God. I, I've been having so many... So many issues. Like I said, I was having problems with wireless and, and then it was having problems with wireless. So the one thing I can tell you, like right up front, uh, I, I like the fact that um, the, the the Samsung, as much as I hate the notches and the cutouts and everything, I found one benefit of having that that the cutout for the the selfie cam. Uh, let's skip that. Oh man, I don't. Uh, I'm gonna have to. I'm just gonna skip it. Skip it. I'm gonna try to do this as fast as I can. Uh, okay. Um, and I can go back and I re restart it. What the hell? Sure. Wait. No, no, no. Cancel. Oh, come on. I, I almost got to a scrolling screen that may have shown an anomaly here. Yes, fine. Okay, fine. Okay, so I gotta unlock the fingerprint thing. Get that set up here. Boop, boop. Just doing the setup thingy. There we go. Edge input next. They, they, they do a more thorough job than uh, Samsung does on the fingerprint. Because, like, I didn't even get the edge input. Not to say that the Samsung Ultra 21S Plus Pro Premium Platinum Ultra 5G. It was so ultra, they added the word twice. Uh, never settle. Really? You sure about that? Because it kind of feels like I did. Uh, yep. They give you a nice little tutorial. Okay, so you actually got to do it. I also like the... Uh, the uh, design of the backwards and forwards more so on the uh, OnePlus. I did. Swipe up from the bottom of the screen. I'm doing Dude, I'm doing it. Yes, I did it. Dude, I'm like... God damn time. Okay. Setup's now complete. I get these, these orange chunks here. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Sure. It's asking me to accept a parking location and all this, like, physical activity and crap. Dude, look at look how many notifications they give you. There's even an Oxygen One or an Oxygen OS uh, update here. What's what's one app that I can use that I know is problematic? Um, oh, man. I don't... The problem is I don't have what I need on here to be able to test it. Um, and I haven't logged in on everything, but I mean, it's, it's fluid-ish. 
one of the the issues really with the uh, the OnePlus devices at this point is largely um, the camera. Like it's it's really um, it's not great. And I can tell you the OnePlus 9 Pro versus the the Samsung Galaxy Ultra 21s plus premium pro 5g platinum lte plus premium samsung is uh the the camera on the the samsung device is like (laughs) amazingly better like it's not it's like not even night and day i mean the 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 device nav is for the most part okay it's it's smoothish I'm trying to, uh, I'm trying to think through, yes, yes, yes. It's, it's throwing all these like, here, this is what you can do. Did you know you could do this? Like at me. And I'm like, I'm good. I know I'm, I'm okay. Thank you. Um, home screen nav was not the, the snag for me. I really don't want to do this, but okay. Um, here's what I'm going to do. Here's what let's do. What let's do. I'm going to do this. I have no idea if this is going to work, but we're going to find out. Um, where the heck is the... Where is the... Alright, no. Okay, come on. There we go. Okay, so... I have no, I have no idea if what I'm about to do is going to work. Okay, so we're going to try this. Because if, if I'm able to get to the Google app itself and see that it doesn't have the problem, I've got a bigger problem on my hands. And what I'm saying, when I say something like that, you have to pardon, I'm like doing this live on Twitch while trying to get a phone set up to test. Um, okay, let's see here. Can't. Okay. <laughs> um, it, what I'm saying when I'm mentioning this is that if it doesn't have the scrolling problem, then suddenly the OnePlus 9 becomes a viable device for me. And I'd sideline the Samsung device, potentially. So I, I that's I'm kind of interested. I think I spelled that correctly. Uh, yes, okay. Interesting, okay. I'm just total. I'm totally testing, oh my god, no, 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 come on. Really? Oh my god. All right. So, <laughs> this is, it's probably, like, doing this live, there's a reason why a lot of people don't do this live, because it's, it's, it's very, no, 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 skip. Gats, okay, fine, agree, I agree, cheese and crackers, just, yes, I accept! Okay, so now, now it's on to the Google app here. Moment of truth. Yeah, it scrolls better. The 9 Pro, I'm sorry, the 9 scrolls better than the 9 Pro. That's a problem. Okay, not by much. Oops, sorry about that. Not by much. Uh, by just enough. Let's see here. Okay, so let's let's try to... I got, I got to look at both of these devices like side by side, right? Not, you know, and you'd say, oh, wait for it to download everything that it needs. Okay, I will. And I'll test again. Don't like freak out. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Wow. Night and day. The pro scrolling sucks. Compared to the regular nine, the pro scrolling. Woo! The pro is bad. You don't want the pro for scrolling. Holy cow, that's bad. 
Oh man, it is not smooth at all. Chop, 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 chop. Yep, yep. And, and don't get me wrong, like when it's caching things, it's a different kind of chop. I'm talking about things that have already been cached. And even if you try to lock the frame rate, it still doesn't happen. So now I'm left, I'm, this is my, this was my chief concern is like, I am left wondering if I can settle, sorry, one plus, if I can settle, sorry, not sorry, settle on the one plus nine, at least for now with a, a, a rather craptacular camera. And that's the best word to, to use to describe it. If I can suffer through it, um, the, the camera quality because of the better scrolling experience. Because of the better, um, it's just the better experience in general. Um, okay, fine. Dang, dude. I gotta, like, set up everything. Yeah, even in photos, I mean, granted, a lot of the stuff is... I, I, I don't have a lot in this particular account, but... Wow. The 9? I will tell you, the 9 is dramatically better than the uh, 9 Pro. And you'd think, wait, but it's the Pro. Yeah, 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 you don't, you don't want the Pro. You, you don't want the Pro. The, 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 the Pro is choppy. Way too choppy. So that's, the Google app is one example. There are some examples where the scrolling perf doesn't take a hit, but there are certain examples where it does take a hit. And that's specifically what I was looking for. The Google app is one such app. Another app where it's very clear that there's a performance problem with the 9 Pro is Twitter. So you might say, well, don't use the Twitter app. I'm like, good luck with that. Good luck. Yeah, sure. I'll use the device as long as I don't use the device then. My, uh, my deeper concern is um, whether or not I'm going to, because I mean, I love the flat screen. I will tell you this. I mean, I'm a flat screen guy. I like the Android experience on OnePlus far more than Samsung. And I, this is just, you know, over the past few days. My question is, will I be able to get along with the camera that it comes with well enough to get me through to the next device that I might want to use? Do you know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that's my feeling. That's my gut. Oh, yes, the 90 does have the 90 hertz or the, the 120 hertz uh, screen. It does. It is fluid. It's very clean. Uh, I have not noticed any scrolling jank. Uh, it's basically the same, basically the same internals. It doesn't have, uh, it's got 8 gigs of RAM, so it's capable of running Chrome 64 bit. And just to confirm, let's go ahead and do a settings about Chrome application version. Oh, I, I, guess, I guess I have to do. How do I do this in Chrome? I totally spaced. Okay. What is it? Chrome colon whack whack version. There we go. This is still the 32 bit, but it's still 86. So when it updates to the latest uh, version of Chrome, uh, it should be fine. Let's go ahead and go into settings here <clears throat> and show you that about phone. <coughs> Wait, where's the. Isn't there, a, isn't there a, oh yeah, right up there, eight gigs of RAM, eight gigs of RAM, 128 gig um, of ROM, which is more than capable for me, more than compatible. Snapdragon 888. In some cases, it benchmarked faster than the Pro, potentially because of the, uh, the, the resolution that it was pushing. But by and large, like there, there are some minor differences in the camera. You're still gonna take really, really bad photos really not great photos with the OnePlus device by comparison, and that can be mitigated kind of-ish. Uh, that's where it's the question of, can I have as fluid an experience, if not a more fluid experience with Android and forego a, a, a camera that I, I could uh, depend on, that I could rely on. The, uh, the, 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 the Samsung camera is, is capable. It is very capable of taking great shots. Very capable. It, it stands well enough on its own. The problem with the Samsung device is that it is, the, the software experience is just crapped up. It is absolutely crapped up. 
Like he's got a billion different things that, that I will never possibly need. So now I've got to make a very, very difficult decision. And it's not going to come down to speed. It's going to come down to what it is that I can effectively live with, right? And and I don't know, I don't know what that's going to be. It's 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 going to take a little bit of um, playing around. Uh, I, I hesitate to say setting up because God, this is like <laughs> the third one I've set up over the past week, and I'm like, I'm not a phone guy. But uh, yeah, y y you're hearing me tell you that. It, the OnePlus is a contender for me. OnePlus, or I'm sorry, the, yeah, the OnePlus 9 Pro, off the table. It, it, up and until, hey, Haley, Haley, good to see you. Uh, happy 4th of July, indeed. Happy 4th of July to you. And good flag day as well on this April 1st of all days. I'm not joking, though. This is no fools. Mmm, these beans are good, too. Uh, yeah, so... Sorry if I was not able to see what you might have been typing in chat it comes down to like the phone the software i mean like the software experience on one versus another and i've tried to de samsung the hell out of the samsung device and it just it you cannot you cannot you can only go so far and man i've even i've even found these uh their apps for Samsung devices. You have to get it through the Samsung store. Thanks for that, Samsung. You can have all these replicated apps, um, including an app called... Where did I put it? Oh, Good Lock. So if you've got a Samsung device, you gotta, you gotta check out Good Lock. That's a recommendation. It's free. And with that, you can... You can manage a few different things. Like, because I was having problems with the third-party launcher. Like, I was using Action Launcher. And I'd used that on the OnePlus 8 Pro, and it was fine. It was ample. Uh, but uh, on the Samsung device, Samsung, for some... S whatever reason... I'm going to stop short. Whatever reason, they have baked in animations that don't adhere to the system like they're like you can exit out of one app and i'm used to like flick 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 like i can but you actually even with the samsung launcher you have to wait a beat if you're not using the samsung launcher if you don't wait a beat the screen flashes and then you can do what you wanted to do like there's some there's some timing issues that samsung's like no we know better no you don't let the system do what it was designed to do. You do what you're going to do. One thing that would sell me on a Samsung device, I'm not joking. The Google Play, remember the Google Play devices that no longer exist and probably never will again? That's what I want. That's it. That's that. If that existed, I'd probably stick with the Samsung device, if only for the cameras. So, better software experience, questionable cameras really horrible software experience better cameras and and that's kind of what i'm i'm going between they're both snapdragon 888 the samsung device has got 12 gigs versus 8 gigs but you know that's a law of diminishing returns am i ever going to see the value of 12 gigs i don't know 8 gigs of ram is all i would need specifically to get a 64-bit browser and that's the, that's key because i use the browser all the time I'm looking for better performance. So now it's going to be, it, it, it's, it's, I'm, I'm going to do some serious testing. I'm going to be like looking side by side, scrolling through. I'm like, okay, what's the perf here? Is this perf good? They may fix the, the OnePlus 9 Pro. I don't know. I'm not OnePlus. I don't know them. They don't know me. I'm off their radar, and I'm sure I've pissed them off enough by now that I'm definitely going to be off their radar. So it's a problem, and I'm sitting here telling you, it's a problem that they may never fix because they haven't even acknowledged it. It's not a matter of price either. It absolutely is not a matter of price for me. Never will be. Never. You know, I'll spend $200 on something if it's a better experience. I don't want to waste $5 on something that doesn't work well. $5 is too expensive. For something that just doesn't work well. Do you feel me? So it's not about the amount of money that goes into it. Thank you for following Red Knight. 
0118. Ah. <sighs> So yeah, that's 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 where I am. That I was I was hoping, I'm 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 serious. I was hoping that I would see a scrolling problem in the One Plus Nine Pro because it would make my decision. I'm sorry. I was hoping I would see it. The, the problem exists on the One Plus Nine Pro. I was hoping I would see the same scrolling problem on the One Plus Nine, which I didn't see. And, and this is the kind of th I see this stuff. It's there! Whether you see it or not, it's there. It is systemic. It's not a hardware problem. It's a lack of software optimization problem. And if you really want to go to bat for OnePlus, how have they been doing with software updates lately? How, how have they been faring with that? Not, not just the new devices, but ones that may have been out for maybe a year or so. How are they doing? How, how, how are they faring there with that? So, uh... Don't get me started on what might get fixed. <laughs> I'm not banking on what might get fixed. Yeah, you know what? I might um, grow a foot a week from now and then be able to reach the top shelf without using a stool. Until then, I'm going to have to use a stool. This is not chili. No, but there, there are plenty of beans inside. This is like Diana's... I, I, I Seriously, I eat beans. It's what I do. Mm. 